what's going on music makers i hope you're good it's a boy honey g welcome to my brand new channel so today i'm going to show you how to make a chord using this loop from this loop okay so i'm going to drop this full instrumental on my channel honey g so go check it out so without wasting time let's get into this <music> a drum loop um so today we are going to 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 estimate we are going to find the chord for this loop so how do we do that uh, so we are going to use sonic visualizer this is sonic visualizer so you gotta download sonic visualizer and its plugins in order to work so what are you going to do so let me drag let me drag the <laughs> Sonic visualizer. So there. So what you're going to do, you're gonna come here, transform and analyze by maker, not representation of chord estimate. Come here, say okay. So it's going to show us the note. Here's the note, the estimate. So it estimated what um the note for this chord for us. So this green thing here, we call them note. So this note thing, they shows us the pitch, the keys around. If you can check this corner here, it's going to show you. It's going to show you some keys here. So then, see pitch. See the C C five. Those are what in duration as well. So let's see if they give us the right the right chords did give us the right chord let's i don't like this sound it's not very irritating so let me come to no. definitely so what you do so i come here and then uh all right I'm seeing my keys. I've seen my keys, so I go back to my Air Force Studio. Then I this is my pattern, and I come here. So definitely, I like to use what I have. So I'm gonna use this Morphine. It's a plugin from an Air Force Studio, and stop plugin. <laughs> okay, let's, so that now I'm going to. I already have my keys. So I have what C5 and G and G and G4 there. And no, not G4, it's a GH4. And we come to. Was it GH4? Or okay, but I think it was GH4. I think it was like this. Yeah, so. And then let's find another key. So there's another key F4, F8, F4, and E5. So F is keys. Another keys as well. Come back here again. Already, I already have those keys. So, right. Hold, hold. Right. We have this one. So let's get. So let's get back to those. Not again. So yeah, if you can take a look down here, it's, it also provides you with the bass note, the bass line note. So, so there C three, and then we have what A H two, we have what B H three, we have what B three. So yeah, so we go we have what we need here. So then we come back here.
then you have your card. You already have your card, right? So what you're going to do is um, I, you have to create um, a sample here that you are not going to use for, for sounding or whatever, but for a guide. So that's why I used this kick, 808 kick too. Then I switched, uh, I switched it here. So you come here. Um, so I'm going to use this for my guide, you know, so that I cannot get out of the keys when I'm starting putting melodies and other things, you know, other mix elements. So what I'm going to do, I'm just copy this. I'm going to copy this, putting them on the higher keys and then lower keys. I can just go on and on doing this. But yeah, that's what it is. So let me show you. When you come here, try to create maybe, uh, let's say we want to create, uh, we want to create a guitar. Remember, this video, it was to show you, showing you how to, how to make a chord using a, a, a loop. You understand? You can do this by even try to make a remake any bit. This is this is the path you can use. So there, so this can guide you, as you can see here. This can guide you. So this gray, gray thing here, are the right keys. This is where you put where your melodies want to play. You you put the notes of your melodies. Do whatever you want to do. You see, but you gotta stay on the key. That's the main goal. So. Uh, so for example, let me just create something for you. creating this for ya for so this on you what you want to do so i hope you have learned 